Where is it to go? Well, now to there, everybody. This is Jordan Jones on the new Super Mario Bros. Wii tutorial recapping strategies. I got those dark ones of this level off screen, and then we finish this boss. And then we're going to do three levels in this video, which will be 8 4, 8 5, and 8 6. And then Kamek goes to the airship. But we'll do that in the next video. Well, this video will have 8 4, 8 5, and 8 6. Next video will have 8 7, and then the airship. And then the very last bit level video recapping it, we'll just have to castle. So this should be pretty simple. Excuse me. At least it should be. Okay, so now we're going to 8-4. Remember important stages of 8-4, you'll have lots of enemies you have to watch out for and stuff. So like we did in the tutorial, remember very important we have to do an 8-4. So we have to hit the switch first, like we did right there. And here's what we have to do. It's like at a dark underwater level, pretty much. It's a much more tedious level than the rest of the levels of the world. <coughs> Excuse me. So remember the important strategy we do in this level. You have to dodge these enemies and then go right here. And here's what you have to do. So you have to do this, just like we did in the tutorial. Pretty simple. Pretty easy, not too difficult. That's all you have to do. For to get that first dark one, that's all you have to do. It will take a little bit of practice at first, because it's a little bit tricky to do that, to avoid these, but you'll get it. A little practice. It just takes a little bit of practice. So, we got our first dark one. Fairly simple to get. And we go inside this pipe to continue the level. So, remember what we did right here. You have these jellyfish you have to avoid. We got hit. That's okay. It's okay. If you do get hit like I did, not a big deal. You have another fire flower right here. We can kill this one jellyfish because we don't really have to have them all to show up right here. Okay, so this part's a little bit tricky right here. So you want to grab this star power. And you want to go for star one number two right here. So this part's a little bit tricky right here. We barely got our star power right here. So what you have to do is you want to grab this. And then you want to use it for the rest of the level. It makes the level pretty simple, don't it? The most important thing to tell you is that you're just going <clears> to... <throat> Okay, the last dark one is right here. Wow! We, that, we did pretty good. That's good. I not think 8-4 would be this quickly, because this is a very tedious and long level. It's not a difficult level, but it is a tedious and long level. And we have 97 one-ups now. So that means two more levels of this video, which will be 8-5 and 8-6. So... So we're not going to worry about using other power-ups right now. We're going on to 8-5. So the one of the most important strategies doing 8-5 this level is the tilt control level. So it should be pretty simple. So it's actually, in my opinion, a little bit easier than 8-4. I'm not saying it's extremely, extremely easy but or anything. But it's definitely not difficult whatsoever at the same time. 8-4 is not super difficult, but it's a little bit more difficult than this one. At least in my opinion. It's actually, in my opinion, a little bit easier than 8 4. So, you want to grab your first dark one there. Very simple, so I do, just like we did in the tutorial. So, remember what we do right here is very simple. So, here's what you have to do. It's very simple. So, here's what you have to do. So, you want to dodge these. You can shoot your fireballs at them easily to get them out of the way. Whoa, we almost got hit. That's okay. <clears throat> Not a big deal. Pretty simple, so I have to do. Pretty simple, so I have to do right there. So here's what you have to do right here. You can get our checkpoint right here, and here's what we have to do. Okay, so remember, you have this fire pillar going up, you have to watch out for. Okay, this second star one's a little bit tricky if you don't know what you're doing. This one can be a little bit tricky if you don't know what you're doing. It's a little tricky if you don't know what you're doing. Here's what you have to do. 
got hit. That's okay. Just grab the ball bomb and toss it at the Stark one, just like that, just like we did in the tutorials. So that's all you have to do. And that's Stark one too. That's all you have to do. Very simple. You know, I said it was a little bit tricky. It can be a little bit tricky for first timers, but you'll get it. Or you'll get it. Or practice. If you keep practicing, you'll get it. It just takes practice, and you'll get it. It is a little bit tricky to perform that, but here, the most important thing to tell you when you're avoiding these crows, just like in the tutorial, is just that you're memorizing the pattern and which way they go, and they anticipate the pattern every time. They're very simple to avoid. I know they seem kind of difficult, but they're not that difficult at all. They're actually pretty simple. Okay. That's all you have to do. So that's all you have to do right there. So we're just hoping we can survive this part. And we can. I know we can. Because it's pretty easy, right? We got hit. That's okay. That's okay. Okay, so we became Baby Mario, but that's okay. Not a big deal. <clears throat> that's not a big deal. We have one more one-up away from 99. So we're going to do one more level in this video, and then after that, in the next video, we'll do the 8-7 in the airship. And then the video after that, we'll do the castle. And then the, and that'll be it for World 8. So I should have started with a power-up, but that doesn't matter. Because we can get a propeller suit quickly in this level. So remember, it's changing we do in 8-6. You want to get the propeller suit early. You want to use it kind of often. So remember the strategy we do in this level. So you want to do this. Propeller suit, we can get it right here easily. So once you get right here, here's what you have to do. Just... Dodge these lava bubbles. Use your propeller to get up to get Stark one number one. Very simple, so I have to do just like we did in the tutorial. And the propeller suit is very important for this level. And Stark one number two is right there. That's all you have to do. Very simple, just like we did in the tutorial. Okay, here's what you have to do right here. So you want a propeller up here. You can easily do this. It's very simple to do. Excuse me. You can easily do it. You can easily do it like this way. One more Stark one to get this level. And that Stark one is... Stark one number three. We can easily propel her up here to get up here. It's very simple to do. We can easily do that. And then here is very simple. You can propel her to that Stark one. It's very simple to do. Not difficult at all. And that's all you have to do in this level. So if we get to the top of this flagpole, we'll done have 99 lives. Just like that! That's all I have to do with these three levels. If you have any questions about these three levels, please feel free to leave your questions down in the comment section, and I'll be glad to answer it for you anytime. To the best of my ability, and we'll be moving on to, we'll be doing the part three of the recap and the strategies next time. Okay, everybody. That was it. Hope it was helpful, and have a good one.